Hello everyone, welcome to Inkijan. In this very very exciting video of algebraic challenging equation from Olympiads. In this video, we will be solving one septic equation x power 7 plus x power 4 equal to x cube plus 1. We have to find out 7 solutions. While solving this problem, I will use algebraic identities, algebraic manipulation, quadratic equation, quadratic formula, real solution, complex solution and we will conclude our result. So let's get started by taking all the terms to LHS. So it equation will become x power 7 plus x power 4 minus x cube minus 1 equal to 0. Now we can see x power 4 is common from first two term. So I will take x power 4 common. What I would get x power 3 plus 1. And from last two term, I can take minus 1 common. So it will be left with x cube plus 1. So major task of factorization is nearly done. x power 4 minus 1 and x cube plus 1. Once you will take x cube plus 1 common out, then it will be left with x power 4 minus 1 equal to 0. Now we have to solve both of the products because we know that f dot g equal to 0 that means either f equal to 0 or g is equal to 0. So there are two equation set I will write here. Number 1 x power 4 minus 1 equal to 0 and second one is the second bracket x cube plus 1 equal to 0. So let's solve both the equations. Let me take second equation first. I will write x cube plus 1 equal to 0. Now turn off algebraic identity. I won't use complex number, the third root of unity. Minus 1 I will write, then I will write in polar form. So a cube plus b cube using algebra where we can write a plus b and in second bracket a square plus b square minus a b. So our equation x cube plus 1 can be written as x plus 1 x square minus x plus 1 equal to 0. Once I will solve x plus 1 times x square minus 1 equal to 0. I can conclude x plus 1 either this would be 0 or x square minus x plus 1 would be 0. Alright, let's 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 find out. So once x plus 1 equal to 0, that means x is equal to negative 1. This is our first solution. We have to find out 7 solutions. Okay. Second, from quadratic equation, so that would be x square minus x plus 1 equal to 0. I will apply quadratic formula. So I will write x is equal to minus b. So 1 plus minus the square root of b square, so negative 1 is square, minus 4ac, 4 times 1 times 1 over 2a. So 2. a is 1. Let's put the values of square and cube. So minus 1 cube will be minus 1 minus 4. Okay. a and c both values are 1. So it will become minus 4 and it is minus 1 over 2. So this will give us again two solutions. See this is plus 1. Again two solutions plus minus sign is there. Minus 1 it is square not cube. Okay. So this will give us minus 3 over 2. That means 1 plus minus i root 3 over 2. First solution was x equal to minus 1. Now there are two solutions. x is equal to 1 plus minus i root 3 over 2. Three solutions are done. 
Now from second equation of the product that was x power 4 minus 1 equal to 0. From here we will get 4 solutions. How? Using algebraic identity a square minus b square can be written as a plus b a minus b. So I can write this equation as x square whole square minus 1 whole square equal to 0. So x square plus 1 in one bracket. In second parenthesis I will get x square minus 1. Alright. Now we have to consider x square plus 1 equal to 0 and x square minus 1 equal to 0. So once x square plus 1 is equal to 0 then I will get x square is equal to negative 1. That means negative 1 is i square. As we know i is equal to square root of minus 1. So we can write i square as negative 1. That's why I have written in place of minus 1, I have written i square. Now take square root both sides. So I will have x is equal to plus minus i. Now total 2, 2 plus 2 plus 1, 5 solutions are done. Now last equation that is x square minus 1 equal to 0. So I will add both sides 1 x square is equal to 1, take a square root both sides, then I will be having x is equal to plus minus 1. Now you can write all the 7 solutions. Let me write here, then I will verify few of the real values. From first equation, it was x is equal to negative 1. From second equation, there were complex solution. 1 plus minus i root 3 over 2. From third equation we have got plus minus i. 5 is done. Now last two solutions are x is equal to plus minus 1. So here we are having 7 solutions. Now if you will check then out of 7 solutions 4 are complex, 3 are real and negative one is repetitive solution. Okay, so let's verify x equal to one and x is equal to minus one. Equation is x power four plus x power seven equal to x cube plus one. So I will write one power seven plus one power four, it is true, one power three plus one, which implies 2 equal to 2, which means it is true. So x is equal to 1, you can immediately verify. Now come to minus 1, minus 1 power 7 plus minus 1 power 4 equal to minus 1 power 3 plus 1, which implies minus 1 power odd, so negative 1, minus 1 power even, positive 1, so 0 is equal to 0. That means this is also true. So we have checked the real solutions. See it is real and this one is real. Rest 4 is complex. You can check for i also. It will verify the equation. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video.